course, on my day off, as soon as I got out of the shower, it was pouring out. It literally just started to rain. And some of my packages came and they were wet, so I gotta get a scissor. I cut them open real fast. All of your getting water all over my floor. But um, from what I know so far, it is. Oh, Lou? Oh, wow. I it was delayed. It's not that delayed if I got it today. So I got a package from Lowe's, Lowe's which should be my kitchen box. Bed Bath Beyond and Geek Piano. Turn this around. So this is Bed Bath Beyond. A candle. I ordered more. Uh, <laughs> freshener oil type things, um, especially for the water. So on my way to get a pair of scissors, I decided to put, I'm sorry, a little bit of moisturizer on my face because I needed it. I needed it. So now, as I have to delay going out, because I'm not going out when it's raining, and it's one of the reasons why I love working from home. I don't have to go outside and get wet. So I don't need to. So I'm hoping it'll stop raining eventually. So let's open these up. So this is the one from Lowe's. Or we're staying out here. Kind of pushing. Getting a free candle too. All right. So let's do. Thanks for being awesome. You're welcome, Lowe's. I do know jobs for the kitchen. Let me figure out where I'm gonna put this. Um, because I was about to just pour this on to dump this onto the couch. These are the knobs to make it handle. I was expecting like a bigger one, but I don't mind it. So this candle is pumpkin banana scone. It smells pretty good. It's like an itty bitty, it's an itty bitty bitty candle. Oh my God, this is so adorable. Itty bitty candle. Pumpkin. Hello. Pumpkin banana scone, can you read it? I know sort of not really, okay. It's pumpkin banana scone, it is an itty bitty candle. What size is this? 1.3 ounces. It is so cute and little. That was my freebie. And then put this for house. It smells delicious. I have one right now in my laundry room. And I got another one. And then I got three of these. Yeah, and I got three clean linen or clean cotton, I mean. No, two clean cotton and one coconut beach. Coconut Beach, two clean cotton. Daniel and I actually like this. Wait a minute. What the hell? I hope it's not all over the place. This one is almost empty. I did not use this. I didn't like this. I might have to go find a Yankee candle. Yankee candle. What? What is this? And it has a black dot on it. Somebody slipped this into my order by accident. This was supposed to be a damaged item. Do you see that black dot? I'm not making this up. Yankee candle, you only one. What is that? I don't know, but I did, it did not come like that, I'm sure. I mean, it came like that, but I did not order a damaged Yankee candle. Clean cotton oil. It was supposed to be two full ones, not one, and then like a smidgen. Oh, this is from Bunny last night, by the way, in case you're wondering. I'm hot, but I'm like hot cold. I need to get my water. What is that Yankee candle? What is that? 
I don't know what that is. What were they thinking when they shipped that to me? I want, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what that was. I got that from uh, Bed Bath the other day. It was custom made. But I don't know what that is. All right, let me cut open the one from Bed Bath and Beyond for today. Here's the still Let me turn it off. Because I was hot before from back in the day. But I'm not hot anymore. What the hell, Yankee Candle? What was that all about? I don't know. I don't know. It's experiencing some strange stuff. All right, let me see what's in. Oh, I need to put this away. Um, my Bed Bath and Beyond one. I need to change out the one we have. So this is Bed Bath and Beyond. It does say it on one of the sides. Uh, no, well, sorry, you can see it. When I open it, one-handed box opening trick. I gotta get these wet boxes into the garage pronto. So I ordered this pre pack of pans from T Fell. I think that's how you pronounce it. Three piece fry pan set. Eight inches, nine and a half inches, and twelve. And Put that down. I think it's the rain stopping. It was sunny before, so I was like, oh yes, I'll definitely go out and bed, bath, and beyond. Bed, bath, and beyond. Okay. And I ordered this. Yes, it doesn't have the foam underneath. The one that we currently have has the foam underneath, and it like the foam just soaks up water and it's disgusting. And I find it very unsanitary. Terry, why is this broken? Oh my god. Thank god it was on sale, but why would they just throw this stuff in the box? It's broken. Uh, I mean, it beats what we currently have, but it's broken. Like my nail. What the hell? This is not a good unboxing moment for me. And then I have serving utensils because we had family over the other day and we don't really don't have any serving utensils, so I ordered some. So I got these and these. Let me take them out of the, the bubble wrap. Hold on. For people with big mouths. Just kidding. It's from a brand called Our Table, if you don't believe me. It's right here. Our table. <laughs> for people with big mouths or for serving. And I got these from, I don't know what brand. It says GS on it. Like a cake server or pie server thing and two big forks. or Forks for people with big mouths. I don't know. So that's everything that I ordered in this unboxing, Bed Bath & Beyond, Lowe's, and Yankee Candle, with the exception of this adorable little candle that I just stuck over here for now. I don't know what to do with it. Can you read what it says, the lighting? What the hell, the flash is on? It does say pumpkin, seed, banana scone. You can see that now, right? Pumpkin, banana scone. Pumpkin, banana scone. Now you can see it. It's so itty bitty, 1.3 ounces or 37 grams. Warning, it's so little. I think that's so cute. We're just gonna put it there for now, next to my Rosie. So that's pretty much it. Can you believe this? It's broken. I don't care if it's on sale. 
This is not acceptable by math. No wonder why a lot of your locations closed. And why are these empty? Why is this one empty? You gave me an empty one, almost empty. Almost empty clean cotton, and there's a dot on it, on it, which for my retail experience means this should have been damaged out. Who the F decided to give this to me? It must be somebody that knows me that doesn't like me. It must be. What the hell? I gotta find my receipt online and complain. <laughs> what the hell? I don't know. So, what the hell? I don't know. I don't know. Well, for those of you who may have enjoyed this video, please give it a thumb up. Sorry, my big hand's in the way. So for those of you who enjoyed this video, see the sun's coming out. It's like we live in Florida, but we live in New Jersey. Give it a thumb up. You can give it two, so you can give it one. And subscribe to this channel, Lulu Live. Actually, no, it's Lulu Live. Well, we used to do Lulu Live. And before that, it was the People Project. Don't ask. Left this on the phone. The sun will come out today. Forgot the flash was on. We have the dopest driveway on the block. Dopest. It, we are so cool. I bet the neighbors are jealous. I know Daniel, our neighbors are probably jealous. Because look at this situation. It's so embarrassing. And look at that one down there. The one over there that has to park on the side of the house. And look at our driveway. And there's more over there. You just can't see. And the lady across the street, she's got a decent parking lot in front of her house. But we got the lot. We got the lot. Mm -hmm. Be jolly. You be jolly. We got the nicest driveway on the block. As far as I know. Ha ha. Okay, I'm leaving. Bye. It's ridiculous. You're going to see it. This is what happened. I got two different things from two different stores. Broken! This was marked, this was um, on sale, but still, Bed Bath & Beyond. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Where is it? On this side, up here. It's hard to tell in this video, but you can definitely see it on the other side. And then look what I got. And I know from working in retail, this dot here means that it was damaged and it was supposed to be damaged out and thrown away. It came like this and there's no oil on anything. It's just, it came to me like this. What the F? Hashtag what the Yankee Candle, you owe me another clean cotton.